Okay, so this video is about my cellular rotary phone. So anyways, um, I've posted videos on this previously, but it's been a while and a lot of things have changed since then. Um, last time I posted a video, this whole thing was just a bunch of breadboards on my desk and wires going everywhere. Now it's basically in its finished form with a few small things I still have to do. So basically how this thing works is, you know, this is just a regular rotary phone, but it makes calls through the cellular network. So there's, um, there's no landline. It's actually 2G. So I have a 2G modem connected to an Arduino. And actually you can see my, my cell antenna right here. And you know, it, it just has a, a plan through T-Mobile. I have a, a SIM card for it. And you know, I got to pay a monthly bill on this thing when I make calls. Um, so basically inside this metal box here, that's where the modem and the Arduino are. And I have some other boards I built, like this board here is an analog board that handles all the voice signals. And then I've got this other board here that's digital and that handles, um, detecting things like when you pick up the phone or hang up the phone or when you're dialing a number by turning the rotor. Um, and then I have a number display here that just shows uh, the number that you're dialing. And this board here acts as an interface between the other circuits I've built and the Arduino in here. So that's kind of a brief description of how it works. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and do a demonstration of this thing. And to do that, I'm gonna call a, actually another 2G cell phone, a, um, a Motorola Razor V3 that I just picked up on eBay. Um, Interestingly, this razor and the rotary phone are actually on the same cell plan. <laughs> so, but anyways, I'm going to go ahead and call this thing really quick. So, here goes. Okay, so this thing should start ringing any second now. There it goes. Look at that, rotary phone calling. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and answer this really quick. All right, so rotary phone connected, that's what we like to see. Um, I'm gonna put it on speakerphone really quick. And I gotta be really careful with this because with speakerphone, it's really easy to set up a positive feedback loop and you get all these echoes and stuff. So I gotta be careful with the volume. And volume is at a reasonable level. So I'll go ahead and say a few things. Hello? Hello? One, two, three. Okay, so you can hear it coming through. I'll turn speakerphone off. So yeah, you can hear, you know, my voice coming through. And of course, if you're talking to this, you're going to hear my voice coming through here. So I'm going to go ahead and hang up really quick. Call ended. That's what we want to see. All right, so now I'm going to call it back on the Razor. So let's see, go to recent received calls and rotary phone. Let's call that. Calling rotary phone. Okay, so this thing will start ringing any second now. There it goes. Pick it up. Rotary phone connected. Perfect. Okay, so now I'm going to go ahead and hang up really quick. Just end that call. Call ended. Perfect. Okay, so yeah, that's, that's how it works. Um, and of course, you know, it's it's just a phone. It doesn't do texting and you know data and all that. It's just it's just voice. But that's what I wanted it to be. So yeah, I've been I've been working on this thing for about a year and a half now. So it's been a lot of work. And you know, my last video was several months ago, and a lot has changed since then. It's still got a few little problems. Um, for example, if I were to call the rotary phone using the razor when I lift the handle off, you can hear a little bit of noise coming through the razor. And that's something I've been 
troubleshooting for a while and I haven't been able to figure it out yet. I mean, maybe I will, but it's not too bad. It's something I could probably live with. So it's not perfect, but it works pretty well overall. And it does, you know, most of the things you would expect a phone to do, albeit, you know, not perfectly. It's got, you know, a few noise issues and, you know, it's not perfect, but I'm satisfied with it. Anyways, that's the basic summary of what this thing is and how it works. So thanks for watching.